Okay, we have been instructed by our managers to ring up the factory and order 5,001 garments for this year's season. First thing the factory is going to ask us is what colours do you want them in and what sizes do you want them in. And what we can use, one of the indicators we can use is last year's sales to give us an idea of how many we should order in each particular colour. So you can see here that um, we sold 231 grey, 197 white and 93 navy for a total of 521. If we break those down into percentages, we could see that almost half of what we sold, 44.3%, was grey. Therefore, uh, we're going to tell the factory that of the 5,001 garments, 44.3% should be in the colour grey. And then we've got the same sort of break up here for the sizes. So we want the information to be displayed here in terms of how many small greys, small whites, small navies, etc. Um, so we can relay it to the factory. Now I'm going to show you a couple of ways in which you can do this. Now you'll notice here we've already got the total for greys in that we want 2,217 garments. So to break that down all we do is pick up the total and multiply it by the percentage that are small, which is 12.3%. Then we would obviously lock, no, we wouldn't, we would lock, oops, the total, because that's not going to change as we drag it down. And the factory now knows to make 272 small greys. We can just drag that one down as such and then repeat the process for the navy. That, that, that requires three formulas to be, can, to be created. So another way which we can do it is we can go back to our original number, 5001, times the percentage that are grey, times the percentage that are small. Okay, and so that's relatively straightforward because we want to know small greys. The trick here is how to absolute this. So starting with a 5001, that one will never move. As we drag this across or down, it will always stay on 5001. So I'm going to absolute K2. When it comes to K9, we want it to go from the grey to the white to the navy. So we want to lock the 9 because grey percentage is in K9. White is in L9, M is in, uh, sorry, Navy is in M9. So 9 is the one to lock. And with M16, this one, because we want this cell to move down to read these other percentages, we want to lock the M because they're all in column M. So it's a little bit confusing till you do it a few times. Um, but one cheats way to remember it is one of the dollar signs will be after the number, uh, excuse me, after the letter, and one has to be before the letter. So if you get them the wrong way around, you'll certainly know and just swap them. But if I do that, I can then drag across, let go of the mouse button, pick it up again, drag down, and it's complete.